You're listening to the My Morning Devotional Podcast, episode 1013. Today's podcast is called Present Help. Hey there, we're the Alessis, a ministry family working together in our church in Miami, Florida. And if you're like us, when days get busy and to-do lists get longer, it can be hard to find devotional time. That's why we've partnered with our friend Allison to produce a five-minute daily dose of heaven. This is the My Morning Devotional Podcast. Well, happy Wednesday. We are halfway through the week. We made it. We made it to Wednesday. Yes. And it's a beautiful, beautiful day. Uh, we pray that wherever you are listening from, the weather is sunny and beautiful. And it is warm wherever yes. you are. I know it is really heating up here in Miami. It's like too hot. It's too hot. It went from the perfect weather to the Ugh. next day. I can't be outside. I can't be outside. And you know, Rochelle, I'm like, did we not enjoy it enough? Like the beautiful, breezy, sunny weather. Um, But we are back for another great episode. I'm your host today, Gabby Alessi. Uh, Rochelle Alessi has been doing an incredible job with all of these devotionals. And I have really, really enjoyed both of them. And just, I hope you've enjoyed listening to them. Again, we want to thank you for your feedback. Yeah. And thank you for messaging us. We've had somebody from our hometown, from our, our home church mm-hmm. responded. We had somebody that messaged us from Michigan. And so wherever you're at, yes. message us. Yes. We love to hear how this is blessing you. So message us. You can send us anything on on Instagram. You can DM us personally or DM um, our account, our My Morning Devo account. But we want to hear from you because you always hear from us. So we got to hear from you. So it's time to hear from Rochelle. Rochelle, take us into this Wednesday Devo. Let's do it. So today's verse is Psalm 46.1. And it says, God is our refuge and strength, a very present help in trouble. And as you can see, this uh, week's theme is all about really just enduring what we're going through and um the great thing about that is that we're all going through something at all times yeah it might be big or small but we always have something that we need help with and here it says that god is our refuge and strength and a present help in trouble Mm -hmm. and i love that and a very present help because sometimes you just don't need the help you need somebody that's present Mm -hmm. helping you somebody that's involved that wants to listen to you, that wants to hear you. That's so good. And the great thing about that is that we find all of that in God alone. Yeah. That he is always present, listening to us, wanting to give us more, present in his relationship with us, but also very present and wanting to help us in times of trouble. Yeah. He's not just a a God that is kind of like a, sometimes we might see it this way where, We pray something and it's kind of like Christmas. Like you have this list, right? And it goes somewhere and then it's either approved or not. Mm -hmm. And it's like God either says yes or no. And then it goes down to the next person and then it gets answered. But this is when we go to God, we're going straight to him. Yeah. And he is present. He's not just somebody saying yes or no yeah and approving or disapproving Mm. he is present right there yeah he's walking every moment with you Mm -hmm. he knows what's keeping you up at night he knows what makes you happy he knows what you love to do the most i mean it says that he knows how many hairs you have and if you think about that we lose hair and grow hair every day (laughs) and he still knows that yeah which means he's so present Mm -hmm. in every moment and area of our life he's present when we are working and we're not thinking of him Mm -hmm. he's present when we are in the car and we are praying to him he's always there and so with that we know that he's going to be a present help Mm -hmm. that when we need him he's there and he's not just telling us what's next but he's right there next to you yeah because sometimes people will tell you you know it's going to get better and look at the future but the truth is is sometimes we're in it yeah (laughs) and you can tell me how it's going to be better but i'm in it right now yeah some days it just it's not fun yeah and in those not fun days he's present with you amen and he's going to surround you and he's going to help you get through it that is so good rochelle you know the the idea of of being present as you're talking about this Sometimes when we go through like a heartbreak or we go through a loss or we go through maybe it's we're going through an injury or surgery, recovery time, whatever it is, you don't you need the help, right? You need somebody to be there and help you through whatever you're going through. But a lot of times you just want someone there just to be there. Yeah. 
it, it's you're lonely you're yeah. your your heart is broken because you you lost a relationship you lost a loved one and people tell you when people are heartbroken the best thing to do is just to sit next to them and be there for them yeah. there's not a word you can say there's not a thing you could do to help them in the moment it's just to be present yeah. and that's what i love about what you said is that that's who god is yeah. that yes we can ask god to help us and he can do the works for us he can perform the miracle he can do it but one of the most beautiful things about God is that he will just sit with you and he'll just be there with you. Be there with you. And you can feel his presence when he's yes. just there with you. Yeah. And you don't need him to say a thing, do a thing, make something happen for you. You just want him to be next to you. Yeah. And I hope that that just blesses people today. I know it's blessing me right now. It's like, wow, I demand so much from God. Meanwhile, he's always there. Let me just enjoy his presence for a little bit. Yeah. You know, and yes, it's the present help. It's the current help, yeah. but it's he's present and he's there with us. And it's his we're in his presence and he's in ours. And I just think that is beautiful, Michelle. Yeah. So let's pray for let's it. it. Dear Father God, we just want to thank you for being present. Yes. Thank you for always listening to us, for providing for us, for being the best that you can be for yes. us. We just thank you for that right now. And I just pray that today. We really just get to enjoy you and your presentness in our lives. So as you are present, we are present with you as well. Yes. That we recognize that you are here with us through the hard times and through the good times. You will forever be the most consistent. Nobody yes. will be as consistent as you are. And so because of that, we will nurture this relationship that we have with you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. So there you have it, your five-minute daily dose of heaven. Thank you so much for tuning in today. We pray these devotionals empower you to take on your day. If you found value in this devotional, share it with a friend, leave a comment or review for us on the app you're using right now. Until tomorrow, we pray that your latte is strong, but your love for Jesus is stronger.